Hello, everybody, and welcome to more October. I'm Benny Caravella, joined by Brad Shoemaker. Spooky Tober. Spooky Tober continues. Trending. Let's get a trending Spooky Tober. No. Hashtag, hashtag the Spooky Tober. Alex Navarro. I still like Shocktober. That's where I'm going. Sure. It's, it's solid. Good. It's, it's a solid one. <laughs> That's like a rock. Right. That's a good point. Someone probably is actually using that already. Oh, absolutely. Somebody, some beer, like a beer company, is that definitely out there talking about Shocktober? Yeah, like Shock Shock Top. That's a beer, right? Like uh, sure, sure. Everything's a beer. We are Sam here. Adams, shock Shocktober Fest. Sam Adams, Adams Tober, Sam. We are here yeah. for for VR in Resident right. Evil Seven. Brad, you are going to enter the the uh, the VR land. It's time so, to do. It's time to do the virtual, and we're all going to try and get our VR legs underneath us as you VR, uh, yeah. as we all attempt. You, you know, there's fingers, like a little ease in. Here we go. Fingers, fingers crossed. I, yeah, it's getting a little, getting a little hot under the collar doing that tutorial, but uh, yeah, are you are you nervous? See how it goes? No, 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 not nervous. Just uh, queasy. Maybe uh, we'll see. We'll see. Okay. I would be nervous. I was, if I was doing what you're doing. I would be nervous. <laughs> so. So the way we're going to do this is you are going to um, uh, go in. Alex and I will be able to talk to each other, but you mm-hmm. are going to be isolated, Brad. Yes, I think that is crucial to debasing myself for everyone's entertainment. That's right. That's need, right. You're going to be need, alone. I need the full scare experience uh, in there. But that's, I don't know. That's kind of why I don't feel super nervous is like, I mean, it's just sensory deprivation in there. I don't know whatever's going on outside. Not my concern. Yeah, so so Whoa. you'll have little help from us, but Alex and I will be able to look at guides and talk amongst ourselves yes. as you're going. Yes. Yeah, so uh, also we're starting with beginning hour, the kind of standalone prologue. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. um, I need to unlock that dirty coin to bring into the full game. Can I get your dirty coin in? Coin. Yeah, you played Resident right. Evil. You know dirty coins okay, are. Okay, get paid. That's, that's right. <laughs> yeah. All right, should we jump in? All right, yeah. sure. Let's All right. do it. So you okay, go through, you nervous. start getting suited up. I'm going to switch over to here. Here you go, Brad, you get in the zone. Alex, you and I are mm-hmm. in the, uh, we're in the, the commentary zone here. I'm going to put up Brad's audio. He's in the here. isolation chamber. We're out here. Uh huh. Here we go. Oh boy. Okay. I'm going to, I'm going to watch this on this other computer here and bring it up. I don't have to stare at okay. that computer. And this is in VR. As always, there is the chance that if you are motion sick, there could be some weirdness around this. I think this will probably be a little bit better than that alien isolation thing because this is <laughs> official. It is not a mod. But who can say? But who can say? So, you know, just uh, you start feeling a little queasy. Don't feel bad about turning it off. It's not for not everyone can handle it. I know sometimes it makes me a little queasy. So like watching, trying to read this menu, I'm going to vomit <clears throat> in my mouth a little bit. Oh, boy. Yeah, that was, that was the other reason that I wanted to start with beginning hour was just give people a kind of an easy out if it does make them sick. I don't know how this will go for people, <laughs> but we All will right. find out. All right. All right. Ready to jack in. All right. So what? So that means you you can't hear us anymore. When's the last time you can hear us? Uh, right now. I haven't, I haven't uh, switched the headphones over just yet. Godspeed, okay. Brad Shoemaker. All right. Thank you. And start the clock. Is, is, it, is it good? I don't. Yes. Yes. Don't do that ever. Ooh. Okay. All right. Okay, all right. All right. I'm, I'm not going getting in. motion sick, so I'm fine. Good. I'm going in. See you on the other side, Brad. As soon as I remember which one of these is the headphone jack. Okay. Bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. Alex, have you played Resident Evil 7? I played a little of Resident Evil 7 and it scared the pants off me. And uh, here's the thing I love horror. I have a mm-hmm. hard time with horror games because horror games, I have to make the bad choices. I can't just watch someone else make the bad choices. Um, so have you played it in VR? I have not played it in VR. I played the first couple of hours of the regular game, and I said, you know what? This is just making me want to uh, run screaming out of the room, so I okay. think I'm going to stop. Uh, I finished this not too long ago. I went through in a, um, in a kind of a lead-up to want to play 8, which I have not played yet. Um, went through all of this. It's pretty good. Yes. Here's the thing. It is a very effective game. Yeah, I did not play. Um, I did not play this in VR. All right. Should be hearing see. gameplay. Uh, you should be. I'll send it over to you. Hold on. Okay. Here we go. Everybody should be getting it now. Here we go. Yes. The gameplay has begun. I hear it. 
Simply Bagel in the chat asked if I played Soma. Yes, I did. I gutted my way through that one. And I played All a right. lot of Amnesia, though I did not finish Amnesia. Uh, and you don't have the videotape, Brad. So I like that we, you and I can talk about Brad's play mm -hmm. style here without him uh, getting uh, getting in. So he's in full VR, checking mm -hmm. around the shelves here. Uh, I, th I want to say I played this, but man, it doesn't seem familiar. He's checking out the controls. I can tell you. I he's... don't think I played this part. Yeah. Is this VR only, this part, or is this uh, something else? This is like, I want to say this was like the demo that came out. Okay. Okay. Uh, someone in chat just asking if we're going to be able to hear Brad if he screams. Oh, yes, his mic is on. You just can't only, hear us. Only one way to find out, really. Make Brad yeah. scream. Scream up, for me! The fuse is missing. Time to find the fuse. Ooh. There you go. There's some Brad. There's some Brad. You think we got a... Uh, maybe I should make a counter, like a Brad scream counter that I can put up... Uh, uh, and we'll, we'll, you and I can decide what counts as a Brad scream. Okay. A bream. Yep, he did exactly what I would do, which is back away from the door <laughs> right after you open it. I'm probably going to jump and scream a few times during this. I'm going to be okay. I'm a very easily startled person. I got, I got startled during the Ghost Hunter stream today, and that game is stupid as shit. <laughs> Good. I'm glad to hear. I wonder how this looks for him, how the textures are holding up. It looks pretty good here. Yeah, it doesn't look so bad here. The stepping is uh, not so bad as in the uh, Alien Isolation. The Alien Isolation mm -hmm. has a little more... Uh, well, that's never a good thing. No! The dogs! Yes. Okay, there we go. It's shaking for effect. They should like make... footage. They should make those, like, uh, you know those fly strips you hang? They should make those look like these things. Like little wicker men Ooh. that you hang from your ceiling. So that when they get covered with flies, it's really disturbing. How long have we been talking about doing this now? Like, three months? A while, I think. I want to say we put it on the uh, one of the patron votes at least, like, two or three months ago. Yeah. We want, And then after that, we're like, we're going to save this for, uh, for October. Brad's been wanting to do this for a while as well. Ah! Oh, it's just a dummy's finger. Yeah. You dummy finger. <laughs> Then why is there blood? He's, listen, a dummy can have blood inside of it. Okay. Can't get out that way. So in this, uh, do you know if you're playing as uh, somebody who's been trapped in the house? Or do you don't know much about this? Like I don't know setup? much about this part, okay. yeah. Vinny, when was the last time you saw the Texas Chainsaw Massacre? Like, I was like eight or something. Like, maybe I saw okay, parts well, of it. First of all, that's a bad time to see that movie. Uh -huh. It's Leatherface, right? Yeah. Yeah, prob probably like around that age of American Werewolf in London and all that Ooh. stuff. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. Okay. How many are there? Uh, If you're talking about like OG movies, I think there's three or four. And mm. then they did a bunch of reboots and updates in like the aughts and teens of okay. this century. Like there's a Leatherface origin story mo movie. I know that, which is like the, the least interesting thing in the world to me. <laughs> I don't need to know how he got the Leatherface. I just need to know that he wants to chainsaw these motherfuckers. <laughs> you don't need some like uh, Joker-esque uh, style lead no. up to. Okay. No, I don't need him to turn to Robert De Niro and say, I'm going to become the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> Just misunderstood, Alex. Mm -hmm. I bet uh, Brad is getting a lot of good positional audio. Oh, yeah. That's the shit that really fucked me up in this game. Like, yes, the visuals are all kind of a nightmare, but like the spatial audio and just the weird creaks and steps and stuff. <laughs> don't like it. I should use the Hitman timer to do like a time until Brad uh, Brad freaks out. Ooh. Gross! Ooh, bad room. I'm gonna clean that up. 
Ah, uh, I bet that smells real bad. You're gonna get salmonella. Dude, you're gonna get worse than salmonella. You're gonna get all the Nella. Ugh. Stop! Well, that didn't. Uh, well, if that didn't get him, nothing will. Gross. <laughs> uh huh. Oh, okay. Okay. That baby's had enough. If you had a key. You know, break the window, right? You if you if, bolt cutters. if I were in this situation, that door would be kicked. The mm -hmm. window would be broken. Bolt cutters are cool. I just rewatched Manhunter for a uh, Waypoint podcast, and bolt cutter bolt cutters figure into some of the investigative part of uh, finding out what the the serial killer in that movie was doing. Cutting bolts. Ooh. Yeah, you should watch it if you haven't. It's uh, the first Hannibal Lecter movie. Oh wait. It's the it's so it's based on Red Dragon, which is the one that Brett Ratner directed years later. Okay, uh, wait, I think it, I saw Red Dragon. Yeah, so it's the same story. It's based on the same Thomas Harris novel, but it was directed by Michael Mann in 1986, and it has Brian Cox as Hannibal Lecter. Okay. It's great. Which one had Philip Seymour Hoffman in it? That was Red Dragon. Okay. That character is played by Stephen Lang in Manhunter, a.k.a. the bad guy from Avatar. <laughs> I want to be a.k.a. the bad guy from Avatar. Mm-hmm. Well, soon it'll be a witch Avatar because those other four movies, those are definitely coming. Or the Airbender. Mm-hmm. I want to be a.k.a. Vinny, the bad guy from Avatar The Last Airbender. You have to return some videotapes. Be kind, rewind. Clancy Javis? This is SVHS. This is fancy. Mm -hmm. Panasonic? Who's the SVHS? Is that JVC? Oh, oh hey! Ah. Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this Wait, time. Wait, this is in the main game as well. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. This new guy? I'm not feeling it. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. Right here. So it is part of the main game, but yeah, I guess you can just plan. do it here. We do a okay. walkthrough of the inside first, then we shoot the intro. Just like we always do. I remember these just guys. Try to say the yeah, same name Who could, how could you forget? These are my favorite characters. No Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking ship. <laughs> Static. Folks, audio all good out there? Sounds good to me, I'll say. Good. I'm Zach we Bacon. Welcome to me getting murdered. <laughs> Everything's gonna be fine. Mm -hmm. Get out of the way. Chat says audio is good. 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 After you. So, why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? It's not exactly haunted. Fuck me. I was an anchor, you know? Weekend sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. What's that? What'd you say? Did you say something? What's the say something kind of sending to me? Abandoned farmhouse, missing family. The only audio Fox complaint is people suspected. want more Brad screaming. We'll get there. This is the I don't know. So far, we got we got a uh, cool, calm collective. Mm hmm. Wait, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. So, uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. I do really like that they give you control in this. Jack mm. and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit! Born under a bad sign. I wore my good shoes. Would you do this? Oh, shit. 
if I invited you. I had my shot. Go to a yeah. swamp murder house? Yeah. Although, this would make a great backdrop. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You would. Okay. Maybe. I would not. Okay. I don't know how long Andre? I'd stay in there, but I might. I would at least entertain the idea. Andre. I mean, I've oh, been in buildings Andre. that are ostensibly haunted. Clancy, you see where Andre went? I wonder if we can get Brad to turn subtitles on. Where is he? Unfucking believable. <laughs> This is the last time I worked with that guy. Oh, that was I, I saw I mean, the producers, They come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy, you stick with me. I would leave. This would be it. Yeah, that would be the moment when I say, fuck it, I'm out of here. I think One as soon as I... was missing, I'm out. <laughs> I think as soon as I saw any gooey meat or anything, I think I'd probably... Because that's recent. That? that meat ain't gooey that? if it's been there a long time. Yeah. I hope Brad gets the good shots here. Want some good angles. Andre, doing the thing where I take one what headphone out, so it's not all. Whenever whatever happens happens isn't all in my head. Oh no, you're already there, dude. I told you I'm <laughs> really easily startled. <laughs> Andre, Mister Three Thousand, are you here? Would you stay or leave? All right, new oh, I'm out. I'm gone. I like a job. I'm, just, I'm gone way before this. Go. I mean, fuck this show. Ooh, oh, we got a little jitter on. A little that. chug. There was a little chug. Yeah. I thought oh, we were man. having like one of those like House on Haunted <laughs> Hill ghost moments there. Yeah, that was pretty good. I, that was uh, creepy in itself. My V mix just got haunted for a second. Yep. You first. <laughs> Need a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. So, uh. I hope everyone first. out there is having a good spooky October this year. Spookiest. Everything's scary. Yep. <sighs> what do you see? What, what do you see? It? What do you smell? What's it sound like? What's it taste like? Put your mouth in there. Breathe real deep. Taste it with that tongue. Put your whole mouth on that shit. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I oh, see yeah, 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 yeah. Put the headphone back in, Alex. No. <laughs> I've still got one in. <laughs> He's crying. Oh. I don't think he made it. Well, then how did the footage get here? Well, mm -hmm. they just left the videotape in the house. <laughs> who labeled the who labeled the tape and, re and rewound it? You. I don't want to be dashed against the stones. Now you know what you need to do, Brad. Mm-hmm. You know what you need to do. Uh, <laughs> you know what you need to do. Us. He heard us. No, uh, I don't think he can. I think he just shares the sentiment. No, I know. I'm just saying, like, yeah. just spiritually, he heard oh, us. Oh, yes. Yes. The vibes have been sent. Uh-huh. Everything down there is good and normal. Probably just, probably just mice. It's an old house, you know. Yeah. Brad's just like, nope, I'm done. He got, he got a key. He's gonna go see if he can use this key to just leave. Uh, fuck. <laughs> there it is. Mm hmm. Oh, I forgot about that guy. Daddy. Oop. Not a good door. Uh 
Uh huh. This is the fight. Good sounds, normal sounds. I, dr I dropped my tools! Now, I know Brad is after the dirty coin, and I don't mm -hmm. necessarily know what that entails, but is. yeah, I can pull up a guide. Those, mo those mannequins are talking. We had a um, mm -hmm. doll makers. Um, mannequin in our basement that scared the crap out of me. One of those mannequin things. Stuff with, always really creeps me the fuck out for some reason. I had like the expandable rib cage, you know, so you could like tailor things for different size people's rib cage. It was, uh, you know. Uh, Hello. Hi, Brad. Hello. Welcome. Hi. Get comfortable. Take your arms off. I'm falling. <laughs> 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 Where do these stairs go? They go up. Eventually. They don't go anywhere right now. Wet and goopy. Nice microwave, though. That's the only <laughs> that one got it's me, it. too. It's the only thing that held up was the microwave. You got the key. Freedom! <laughs> oh. Ah, fuck! Jesus. <laughs> oh, man, that, that's all you just got. You got a hook right there. <laughs> you thought you were getting out. Okay. Bad, bad ending. ending. Bad ending. Only bad ending. Brad, bad ending shoemaker. Uh, we only have to wait until January 2017. It's not that, hey, time's moving quickly. All right, I'm gonna, now I'm gonna bring up a guide to make sure if Brad wants, I can give him the answers he needs. The answers he deserves. Mm-hmm. How to get that how to get that dirty coin. Ooh. Yeah, you don't have your items anymore. Ah. Oh. <laughs> ah. Oh? Found the fuse. These fuses are weird. Wax paper. Yeah, here you go. Love a good piano <laughs> bong. That probably makes the stairs thing go, I would bet. Mm hmm. sounds, normal sounds. Family! Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, the dummy finger. Mm-hmm.
He knows what's up. Just get out of here. Get the ass, get the bolt cutters, yes. Watch the mm -hmm. doll yeah, fall. Stupid baby. Uh -huh. Baby can't hang on to a rope. Baby was like in the corner of the ceiling ready to assassinate you. Nobody puts baby in the corner of the ceiling. <laughs> okay, VHS tape. Got your videotape. Uh huh. I wonder if you have to do the videotape. I bet you don't. Yeah. Everything's fine up there, Brad. Just push mm -hmm. the little button. Make the daisies come up. Push the little daisies. Mm hmm. Oh, the. F oh. 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 Well, this is encouraging. Go on. Th those look like very solid stairs to me. That's very well made, very well constructed. I foresee no way in which this goes bad. <laughs> right with the quick turn. Okay. Electrical is run here very well. This looks up to code. Got some lathing on the walls there. No insulation. Everything's this is all gonna check out. This is gonna pass. Mm-hmm. See no problems here. <laughs> you know, are you a contractor? Did you do this yourself? This all looks very good. Open the door, Brad. Come on, Brad. Open what could be door. in here? Just a mannequin. Nothing to be alarmed about. Shenan shenanigans. Okay, no. <laughs> Sh I, shena I will not grant you that one. <laughs> Is that to some shenan shamanic? Huh. Whoa, it's like watery. Midnight shamanican. No, okay, that's you took that too far. Yes. What is that? Oh, it's a picture of a helicopter. A Huey. We call him uh, Hueys now. Enter the phone, Brad. It'll ring, right? Probably. You don't put a. That's Chekhov's phone, man. You don't put that phone there unless it's gonna ring, menacingly. Mm hmm. Man, look at this electrical work. This is like my basement. Operator. Oh, is your fridge running? Hello? No, just answer. Is your fridge running? Oh, God. I can never have any fun. Um. Oh. Yes. That's a place you want to go. Oh, Brad, Brad has played some uh, Resident Evil. He knows what happens when there's a box with some tape around it. Mm hmm. He knows what it says, what to do when someone says, go to the basement with a key. Go to, oh. Ooh. Ooh. Don't have a handgun, but. Ooh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. yeah, he's happy. He's nodding in approval of the bullets. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hello, hi. Hey. Hey. Hey, ladies. Mm. Oh, so you found the handgun bullets. Okay. Ah, you found our barbed wire window. Oh, not going up there. Okay. I don't think there's really anything for him to do up there. I think that I believe that will come into play later. Ooh, Brad loves a CRT. Yeah. yeah. How do you plug the video in? Where's the Where are the video inputs? No video inputs, just from rabbit ears. Gosh, you would kick that thing open so hard. I would literally headbutt that thing <laughs> to death if it That's, meant I could get out of this place. That CRT would be going out that window. Yep. I would just using mannequins as fucking battering rams. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry, ma'am. Excuse me, I'm so sorry. This is my fault. Sorry. See you next fall. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Look. What is happening over there? I think he needs a knife. <laughs> so I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mannequin physics. Sorry. It's supposed to be quiet here. Sorry.
plop, plop, plop. I do love the implication here that, like, not, I mean, clearly they know you're in the house because we see, you know, the dude creeping around and whatever, but also with the amount of noise you're making <laughs> in here, they would hear you two counties over. <laughs> yeah, maybe he's trying to, that's his call for help. He's trying to get the neighbors to come knock on the door and be like, hey, can you keep it down a little bit? We know you're a murder house, but do you have to be so damn loud? Yeah. You never used to be this loud when you were doing murdering. Those are the sounds you want to be hearing. Yeah. <sighs> oh. 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 <laughs> oh. Black mold. I'm dead now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's the correct response, Brad. <laughs> Only he had a gun. What's it say? It says basement. 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 Well, go take a shower. Wow, look at the size of this bathroom. Oh, this is a half bath or a full bath. Oh, that's full. All this full ammo, no gun to put it in. What is that? What is that, a rabbit? What is that? May have been at one time. Yes. No monster could possibly operate a doorknob, Brad. <laughs> Brad, I know you want that ammo. Uh. I know you want that ammo. You gotta put your- just grab it with your teeth. Okay. Mm. Okay. Let's go check that shower out. Teams are not really meant for people with anxiety disorders, I've found. Probably not. Probably not. Oh, boy. I respect the hell out of them, though. I really do. I have tried washing my bike also. And, Ooh. uh... Look, the chain just needed some lubrication. Hmm, oh. Does he have something? Put the f <laughs> stick the finger in it. Ooh. That toilet, uh... Oh, that's gonna back up. Uh oh. Oh, he needs to change the valve? Okay. Hey, let me ask you something, Alex, as someone who's mm -hmm. colorblind. Is that water, is it just brown and black, or is it red like blood? It has a little bit of a deep red going on, at least from my perspective. Oh, it does, okay. I mean, it could just be very rusted, but it, mm. it, it didn't look right. Oh, well, that's, uh, your fate is unwritten, Bradley. I also just, I love what a big swing they took with this game. Like, Resident Evil had become so blah before this game came out. Hmm. <laughs> and they challenged a lot of assumptions about what a Resident Evil game needs to be. Just like Brad is about to be challenged here. By something. Gross. Ooh. Is this the basement key? Oh boy. Oh, look hey, at that. You know stuff. Look at this. Oh, don't touch those. Oh, you need like a tetanus shot for that. Also, this is just incredible texture work in this game. Oh my gosh. Somebody saw some close up grunge. Dang. What's the worst building you've ever been in? Like, most just abandoned, decrepit, fucked up building you've ever been in? Um, you know, there were some like, uh, rundown factory style things that we used to tool around in that we'd find. Mm -hmm. But I can't I can't name for certain. Okay. Um, but like the type of building where it's just like, yeah, this is like a you know, concrete mostly, dank water has gotten in here, broken windows, probably dead animals. 
Mm -hmm. Also, my basement. Okay. Ah, your basement's fine. <laughs> oh, that's it's right. I forgot. Basement. You've seen it recently. Yes. Oh. That's just that's just the water. That's don't mind that. That yeah, you've got those in your basement. Like those are like they just come with the house. That's just Christmas trees, man. You, those are yeah. just Christmas trees. They're ready for the ready for the holidays. Happy holidays. Uh, my answer to that question is probably Eastern State Penitentiary in Philadelphia. Okay, it's very specific. I wasn't there at night, but I did go on a tour. That place is uh, falling the fuck apart, and uh, but also kind of fascinating. Was it shut down? No, it, like they do tours. Okay. It was operational. No, I mean it's not a prison oh, okay. anymore. It hasn't been for oh, okay. a long time, but it's it, they do tours of the place. Uh, Brad, <laughs> Brad, don't play with your food. Brad, sadist, sicko. Oh, now stick it in the back of your head and go mm -hmm. download some video games and buy some knives. <laughs> no. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, <laughs> Something uh, got bread. Oh, oh boy. Uh, use your throw your bullets at him. Oh throw your God. bullets. Punch that guy. Get out of the fucking way. Go, Don't man. Oh, here you go. Here you go. He's going to get it. He figured it out. You figured it out. Nice. That guy's an idiot. Open. Fuck. What the fuck? Uh -oh. <laughs> hey. Oh my god. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh, Brad don't like it in here. Oh no, this is a bad room. I don't like it either. I'm not really sure what he's supposed to do here. What? <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. <laughs> You are dead. Hmm. Hmm. Checkpoints? Check. I don't think they do checkpoints, or maybe they do. Well, I, I don't know if they do them in the demo. Uh. I'm going to look up and see. Um, Alex, would you like to know if he missed a gun? Yeah, I would. Okay. I also want to. I'd like to figure out where that coin is so we can like direct him to it at some point Ooh. if we need to. Okay. Okay. Get the valve wheel. Okay. Turn around, 180. Brad will get in contact with us when he wants to, so. Says, Don't okay, here's what, here, Alex, here's what we're looking for, okay? In that room okay. he was in with the monster, it seems like there's a doll on the shelf. And the okay. attic, and the, next to the doll is the attic window key. Okay. Which is the thing that he was trying, yeah, the window he couldn't get out of. I remember that. Yeah. Uh, you can kick the monster. You kick the body into the monster. You can block, yeah. right? Uh, you can block. I think you can block in the demo. You can block in the real game. Okay. And then I guess you go back out that door. Oh yeah, you go back out. Jack, the the guy will disappear. Okay, so he was close. He just uh, he probably didn't check the door again. Now the question is, is Brad, does Brad feel like he was ne he's never going to be able to get out of that room because he thinks that guy's always going to be blocking the door? It's a good question. He was trying to go back to the door, I think, when that monster got him last time. Mm. I don't know, what, what does this dirty coin get you? That's a good question, and it sounds like getting the coin might be kind of a pain, because I think you might need all five of the mannequin fingers. Oh, boy. So maybe after this run, if Brad doesn't get out through the window, maybe we try and uh, wave him down and be like, hey, <laughs> just so you know. And if he wants to go try and find those fingers, by all means, he can go find those fingers, but... We let him know what he's up against? Mm-hmm. Because I think if he doesn't know... Yeah, 
and he might get into a bit of a, a stuck loop here. That said, if he wants to do that, I'm all in favor of it. I just want to make sure he knows. Hey, chat, what does that coin get you? It helps you buy stuff. Oh, is it just a coin? If it's just a coin, I think he's going to be fine. Yeah. We'll let him go through this run here and see how he does, and then I say, let's flag him down and just kind of let him know. I don't know how we flag it. We'll have to get a bat signal up. Yeah, okay. If it's just one of those coins from the game, you do get a bunch of them. Yeah. The ones that... Hey, Chad, is it the ones that are at, like, the bird... The bird cages? Because here's the thing. I, Brad does want to play some of the main game. I know that. Okay. Okay... Now he's looking for the attic key here. Oh come! Oh come on! <laughs> Shit! Hi, that guy. Uh. Nice. Okay. Nice. Good moves. Good little kip up. Okay. Oh, God damn it! Oh, you're Try so slow. Again. Try the door again. Well, he, I don't think he got the attic key. No, he didn't. He's close. He's close to finding it, though. Oh, there. Okay, good. Okay, he's got, he's got the attic window key. Now he just needs to get out of here. Now he knows it's there, at least. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he can get around this dude. God damn it. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. Right, so he figured out the attic key. He did yeah, figure yeah. out that it was there. So we do know he's going to get back in there to get that attic key. I don't know if he knows that. Uh oh. I think he's uh -oh. gonna. Uh oh. He looks like he's, he's switching he's over here. Uh huh. It's... All right, we might be getting contact. Okay, time we're gonna. Here. Let's be <laughs> ready. Getting, uh... Hello. Hi. Hello. Can you Hi. hear us? Coming, coming in from the virtual. Hello, Bradley Hello, Shoemaker. Y'all, y'all, y'all know where I can get a gun. Right. So. Uh, we have some information for you, if you would like it. Well, uh, a lot of what you were doing well, was very much on the right path here. Well, okay. Don't. don't straight up tell me, but if I'm, like, missing anything major, a hint would be good? Well, so there's a couple of things I just want to put in front of you, which are not going to tell you anything specific, okay. but, um, I, the, I, I the thought, dirty... I thought, oh, go ahead. Well, say so the dirty coin really only gets you, lets you purchase stuff in the main game, so I don't know if you need that. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, I know, I know what it does. Okay. Alright. We um, have, we have heard it's kind of a pain in the butt to get, uh, if okay. you, uh, you do have to get a lot of stuff to do it. Okay. Um, a number okay. of things. All right. Maybe I won't go for that, but I would, okay. I would at least like to see this through. The, the thing that, the, the, I will say the guy that I have read does not have you getting uh, a gun for that monster. Huh. Okay. I thought going down there and getting that valve, I would be able to just turn right around and go back up and use it. But, but do you have other so ideas? I think, I think you can get out of that room. It's just that first time the dad blocks it. Hmm. Yeah, okay. you should you should um, try that door again. Okay, it's really it's hard the to line block up. Button, the block button is your friend. Okay, yeah, it's really hard to line up that corpse and that monster. Like it wasn't For sure. connecting every every time I tried it. All right. Okay. All right. Yeah. Don't forget the block. You got this. Okay. I feel we feel good. Right. You know what you need to do. Okay. You're pretty much on the right path here. Okay. All right. All right. All right. See okay. you on the other side. <laughs> All right. Pretty streamlined. All right. Okay. And in he goes. Okay. Brad, can you hear us? Okay, he's in. He's in. He's in. Do you um? Do you think he's gonna block? I think he knows that he needs to block. Will he do it? I don't know. Hmm. I'm looking in this guide for a revolver or gun. Um. I don't know if they give you the gun in the demo. I don't. I'm not I don't sure. I'm not, I'm not seeing. It. I mean, they could certainly give you those bullets, but. I mean, it might just be one of those things because, like, those are bullets you find in the main game. Yeah. Oh, 
a boy. Okay. Brad wants that coin. Mm-hmm. We didn't tell him actually that he needs all the fingers. No, we just, just said, said he needs to collect stuff. Yeah. What Brad doesn't know is he needs some fingers. Mm -hmm. Get them fingies. <laughs> he needs those doll parts. Mm -hmm. All right, I think we're gonna we're gonna head to the basement. Oh. Ready the bolt cutters? Do you need the bolt cutters? Oh, give no, you a I'm thumbs yes, up. Sir. Yes, I do. Okay. Hey. Doesn't hurt. Like. Like not having the bolt cutters, you could probably get through it, but. Like right, audience, I'm gonna shrug my shoulders and say, I don't, I don't know. I didn't memorize this whole thing. Just, would it hurt to have the bolt cutters? Probably not. It's... I mean, I guess it takes up inventory space. Yeah. I think he can do it without it. It was just really, it was really just that one cabinet, right? Mm. It's hard to express, use the bolt cutters and then ditch them. Whoa. Oh, he's already awake. He didn't get the attic key. Well, no, he's got to go to the door, I think. Oh, to get he's going to do his, to... he's going to do his business here. His dark business. Okay. Yeah. He's triggered the dad. Dad. Hey, go get okay. that. Look at him blocking. He, oh, he he's was trying. blocking. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. He's got laughing Jack. He's lining up. Oh, come on. Mm. Oh, I thought he had that. Yeah. Yeah. That did seem a little. Okay. Good block. Good block. Good block. Good block. Okay. He's trying. He's trying here. Okay, oh another. Go okay, that body's no, that gone. Body is done. He did not oh, get, he the, get the. He did boy, not he get, the, get the, key. the attic key. I think he knows. I think he knows he needs the key. Okay. <laughs> and a little bit of. Uh huh. Ow, my hands. Oh no, oh, Brad. No, no, no. Oh he might boy. Be without the key. Okay. Uh. Well. Hmm. Mm, well, no. Okay. The, I, I wonder if he's going to go to the attic and realize he does not have the attic. Ooh. He might. I, I, that's what I, my guess is at this point. I mean, he survived the encounter, so we are making progress here. Yeah, he's going to let's, let's drain the bathtub a little bit. Okay, I got these little arms. Mm-hmm. The arms of sorrow. Now flush now that toilet. Flush that toilet, man. And then reach your hand in there. Gun. Oh. He's found the gun. does not like the sounds he's hearing. It's a little gurgly. Is there no melee in the in this demo? I thought there was like a no, swipe. No, just blocking. There's like a swipe or something. Like uh, break boxes. Like click in the stick. You need the for that, don't you? Oh, do you? I don't remember. Now go down there, shoot that guy in the face, and get that key. Oh, he's only got three... Oh. oh. Hey. That's probably bad, right? Hmm. 
He's only got the three bullets. Which is not enough. I don't know if it's enough. I don't know, actually, I don't know how many bullets it takes to kill that thing, so, or if it can, even. Kind of depends on the weapon. I don't know. Okay. Boing! Seriously, you're like Jerry Lewis in this place. <laughs> I don't think that back door is the way out. Was there was there ammo in here? I don't remember what I was think, in here. I think there is ammo in here. Or no, maybe it's a doctor. Maybe it's a, oh, this is the videotape. Oh, That's what it video is. tape. Okay, okay. I still don't think that's the exit, but... Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the gross thing. <laughs> that thing is probably cleaner than most of the things in this house. Get in Ooh. there. Don't run with that. Oh, man. And he's like, I wish I had this <laughs> earlier. Okay. Yes, put your drawer, close your drawers, you know, be polite. Okay, try that hatchet. Normal there house you noises, you know. Uh-huh. A good attempt, good attempt. Yeah, I don't think that's the door. Think he's gonna go for the monster? It's what I would do, but Hmm. You know. I wonder if he's going to go for the videotape or he's done with that. I think he might be done with the I, videotape. I would say I'm done with the videotape. Alright, heading back in the direction of the monster. Mm. He's thinking about it. Giving it a good hard think. You have an axe, you have a gun. These are things you did not have before. Uh-oh, oh, who's coming out? I think Brad okay. has a question. Okay. Okay, here we go. Uh, question Hi, for Brad. Me. This, is, this, is, this is rough without being able to save. Uh -huh. uh, should I go fight that monster just in the interest of time or so interest of not repeating everything again? So you did forget something down there. Was it, is, was it the key? There was uh, a key yes. down there. Oh, right, in the back, yes. Okay. Yes, that's not by the, the front door key. No. Was that no, the, it was the attic key. That's the attic. I assume that was the attic the key. Attic okay. Key. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess I'll go see <laughs> if I can fight that thing then. Where, do, do you remember where the front door key is? I can't. I can't remember where that was. I don't know if you found that. Yeah, you found did you that find the it? Door key. I did. I did because it was the first time I died. I opened that door. That's how okay. I got the bad ending. I opened that front door and the dude oh, killed me. Oh, right. And I got right. the bad ending. Okay. Maybe I don't need it because I don't. I don't remember where that key is, but maybe I don't need it. All right. Well, back into the basement, I guess. Bye, Brad. You got an axe. You got a gun. You can do this. Uh -huh. Three bullets. Don't need more than that. All right. And in he goes. Ah. Uh. There's a. Uh, I guess there's like a Resident Evil Four port that's coming out for like the Quest Two. Oh, wow, really? Oh, he can't find it. I saw an ad for it the other day. I was like, wait, that's happening? Looks like he's trying to jack into the Matrix back there. Yeah. Psst. 
Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Let him know That's you're coming. That's right. Brad's coming. It's going with the hatchet, not the gun, huh? Brave. You know, that's probably what I would do. Mm -hmm. Even if it's the wrong decision, it's the wrong decision I would make. All right. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Start with start with those. Oh, he's put himself in a corner. Okay. Fucking hell. Uh huh. He's got Axe. the right idea. Oh, I can block from the attack animation. God. Oh, you're dead. What do you think? Should we nudge him into the main game? We should let him get, get through this. Mm. Probably, probably wants to kill that monster. Can you kill that monster? Sure, you, I, I assume you can kill that monster. All right, he knows what he needs to do. Okay. I do think he could probably like speed run it at this point. <laughs> I mean, I, I, you know, at some point I could just read him off the list of things to do. Mm hmm. Also, it sounds like you actually don't need five fingers, but you do need to find a dummy hand, and you have to do something with that hand in the mm. finger. Oh, yeah, you do. I'm sorry, what's that supposed to mean? Like, high-five it. Oh, okay. You gotta high-five it, and that's how you get it. Now, if I were Brad, I would, I would think, okay, I want that hatchet. As soon mm -hmm. as possible. I want the hatchet. Get as gun, many bullets as I can ready. Yeah. So the gun was in the toilet. Mm-hmm. As all good guns are. And then the hatchet was... Where was the hatchet? Was it like a box oh, or something? Was in that, it was in that locked drawer. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So he needs a lockpick. Yeah. He's gonna get it. I think this is the run. I think if he escapes the house, he's gonna be happy. Mm-hmm. I agree. Now, and now if he, not bad ending. If he escapes the house and he's been hit by the monster, he probably will get an infected ending. Mm-hmm. So that I think uh, that would be fine. You think he'll be okay with that? I think he'll be okay with that. Okay. God, just that the once you know that baby <laughs> is there and it falls, like it's just such a like. <laughs> Ignore the videotape. I respect that. Do you I remember where the lo the lockpick was? Is it in the basement? That I don't remember. Okay, it's cruising. More bullets. Grab some ammo. He knows what's up. All right, he's right into that basement. Doesn't even have his weapons yet. Doesn't matter. He's gonna get that valve. He's gonna get out of there. Somebody's cranky. Okay. He knows what's happening here. He's going to get that key. Should go get that key first is what I think. He's waiting for that thing to show up. Uh -huh. Okay, grab that key. He's feet, got it. feet to the... Uh-huh. Yeah, block the attack and just get past him. Out of the way. Uh-huh. Get daddy. Yeah, it's going to be there. It's going to be annoying. Okay. I'm going to smash this guy in the face. Boom. Ow. Now okay. get your ass out of there. Okay. There you it. go. That's that's the efficient uh, Brad I was looking okay. for. I got turned around. Well, he's got to kick it a couple of times. Yeah. Okay. Bang. Uh huh. Bang. Get over here. Uh huh. Oh, you asshole. Okay. Oh come on. Oh, get oh out boy. Of there. Oh boy. Not happy about this. He's going. Get on out. Get on out. 
Ooh. Fuck this place. All right. Now I think he is infected. Eh, who cares? Infection and schmection. That's what I say. That's, infection and schmection. <laughs> He's got the blank notebook that is an integral part. It is? I think it's part of the, like, golden, the dirty coin thing. Hmm. All right, he's gonna get his piece. Okay. Only two bullets. All right, he does have this attic key. Ugh. Okay, and he's infected. Is he gonna just go up? Is he gonna go I back down there? There's nothing he needs down there. Is he gonna go? Is he gonna go get? Oh, he's getting that hatchet. Okay, no, that's you know that's not a terrible idea. To the attic. Hmm. It's just a little infection. He's still good. Anything that like blossoms out from like your veins, that's generally never frowned good. upon. Yeah, you don't want that. <coughs> He's fine. He's fine. 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 Hey, fine look, fine. it's a dusty Ooh. house. It's it's pain means it's working. Pain don't hurt. Get out of there, man. It does, it does seem like he's hurting a little bit. Hey. Uh, don't take the time to make a phone call. Come on now. Also, you don't want to put that thing in your ear, speaking of infections. Oh, yeah. He's just teasing us at this point. Just he knows. Hatch at that box. Look at this. Look at this. He's getting out. He's getting out. The man is ready to leave. Oh. The man wants oh, no. to leave. He wants to go home. He's. Oh no. Oh boy. Am I gonna? Am I gonna be okay? Boy, you are nothing. Just man. What? Didn't seem. All right. Well, that's the infected ending. Okay. I think we're gonna we're gonna check in with Brad here. Mm hmm. Okay. Infected ending. The infected ending. Infected so, ending. What do you have to do? To, to do you have to do you have to not get hit at all? To you have yes. to not get hit by the monster. Not get hit. Cool. Shit. Uh huh. Uh. I mean, is there a lot more if you didn't get hit? Uh, I think it's just w one more ending. So, to get the... You want the true ending, or are you looking for that dirty coin? Well, either way, I'm just asking if there's more game there if you don't get hit, or is it just you get a different ending when you go through the window? Let's see. Uh, basement key, you did that. Confront the monster without getting hit, uh, which is sounds pretty tricky, and then escape through mm -hmm. the attic. I don't think there is that much more. I think it is... Okay monster uh and then get out through the attic and that's the does true block, ending does blocking count as getting hit i think blocking my count is getting hit but i can't be sure it doesn't say oh, here. Tough. This, this just says like yeah. don't get hit the thing is big it's kind of hard to maneuver around yeah and then well, the, do you want to do you want to think about take, getting into the main game i could well, sure yeah you want to jump in that's what everybody wants to yeah. jump in let's start this thing up okay all right all right Yes. Okay. I need to I need to stand up for one minute. Okay. And then I'll get in there. All right. Dirty coins. Done dirt cheap. Ugh. 
So the, uh, to get the dummy, uh, to get the, the the coin, you just need to you had to collect a bunch of stuff and solve puzzles and, and things that are in the environment. Oh, just, weird. Uh, I, yeah, it's, I didn't see any puzzles. The stuff yep. was not very obvious. Open your inventory, combine the dummy's finger with the object made of celluloid that you picked up and blah, blah, blah. <laughs> so this, yeah. Boy, sounds like a Resident Evil game. Read the bookcase. The whole thing. All that fun stuff. All right. All right. I'll be right back. Okay. Right. Here, I'm going to switch it over. Uh, switch it over to us here. Ooh. Oh, right, boy. a little breather. Yes. Alex. Mm-hmm. How's it going? How do you feel about our boy so far? I think he's going to do all right. I think the main game is a little, um, maybe a little scarier, but I think he's going to be okay. He's, he's, I'm excited to see him though. Like, so again, mm -hmm. I, I played this not too long ago. I think you got some frights coming up. I think we're going to have oh, some yeah. pretty good scares. How deep into it did you get? Me? Mm hmm. A couple hours. Okay. I'm, I'm curious. I think the beginning of this game, the house, the first part of the house is very, very, very good. And I think going on from there becomes more of a video game. I think we're going to get less, more of a Resident Evil game. Yeah. Yeah. Less, less creepy as, as we move on. But, um, I'm going to see how Brad does in this early house. Or yeah. Early, early going when you're, uh, before you make it out of this first area. Pretty good stuff. So I'm excited to see that. I'm excited to see the, uh, the pig cage back there. The who? The pigs. Oh, oh, oh okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The guinea pigs. Mm -hmm. Got it. Gotcha. Folks out there, how's everybody doing out there in the internet land? Out there watching thanks for watching as we prepare to jump mm -hmm. into resident evil seven for real proper prop proper brad was just getting his legs about him and now i think he's ready i think he's ready for the true horror it seems like the it's holding up i didn't get too queasy watching that one that was no, pretty good not at all uh which i'm glad i'm glad for that uh folks uh, in the chat says i watched a vtuber with a heart rate monitor play this recently oh wow that sounds intense that's what, i don't know if i'd want to do that just because they might have to like call a doctor yeah like, Oof. do you know why i couldn't pick up that ammo in the bathroom i don't know if you have to smash that cabinet so um I don't oh, know if you, maybe with I, the the axe or something axe. yeah i, don't, I honestly yeah. don't know uh you're gonna weird. get you're gonna redo a lot of this stuff in the main game oh really yeah so oh, like, yes not beat for beat, but you're gonna you're gonna be in the same area. Oh yeah, yeah. I assumed they would reuse the level. I was under so, the impression that prologue stuff was different content, though. But it might be remixed, see. but uh, it might be paced I, I differently. See. Yeah, I see. I see. You, okay. you were definitely doing some stuff that I was like, oh, you do this in the main game. Like okay. the videotape oh. thing is definitely something yeah. you do in the main game. Okay. Well, now I got my VR legs under me. Yeah, jump in. Let's do it. We got about right. a, uh, an hour ish here. Okay. All, All right. right. All right. Jump it in. Is this... Well, I'll find out. I was going to ask how the save system works because playing that without saves was kind of rough. Uh, I rem we'll I don't see. remember the save stuff being okay. uh, too big a hassle. Okay. No ink ribbons. I don't think so. Okay. Well, we'll find it's been out. been long enough that I've kind of forgotten, but... We'll find out. All right. Here it goes. All right. See you, Brad. All right. Uh, chat folks, uh, mostly everybody in here beating this big old quick. Yes or no. Yes, yes, yes. No, 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 no. Uh, I, I Alex, you're a no, right? You have not beaten I'm this. I'm a no. I have not yeah. beaten this. Okay. We've got a lot of no's. Decent amount of yeses. Yeah. Okay. VR yes in there. Okay. Mm, the truly brave hearted. Yeah. Okay. Too scary. I like it. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I, I did this not too long ago again, and I did the, all the DLC, and I thought the DLC was pretty fun as well. Some of it better than others. I didn't spend too much time in the, like, I wanted the story DLC, so I didn't spend too much time in the non-story DLC. All right. There we go. I'm going to switch it over here. All right. Here we go. Oh, um, 
yeah, sorry in the chat. I uh, a few bad dudes. I wonder if we can if Brad will have the subtitles on for the main game. We'll see. Yeah, it might be nice to get them on. I don't know if there's a, if the next time uh, we catch his eye, I'll try and get them on. Let's see if I can uh, maybe send him a text. Alert! 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 Hmm. I'll send him a text. Maybe his phone will beep. Okay. I texted him. Subtitles on. Subtitles on. There we go. Got it. Okay. He's got it. Great. Yes. Good. Good man. All right. And there we go. It will be broken from now on. Okay. I like this cautiousness. Nothing spookier than a Eula. <laughs> yes. Mm hmm. Not normal. It's going normal here. Wow, that's a lot of options. Okay. 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 Audio scary. Good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, deep breath. He's got this. He, yeah, he okay. didn't need a tutorial. That was the tutorial. He's ready now. He's good to go. Hey, baby. I just wanted to send a quick hello, and I love you. Oh, good news. I'm going to be coming home soon. Yay! I'll put this in, but I cannot wait to be done with this babysitting job. I gotta be honest, I feel like they did not do the best job of making her not creepy before <laughs> stuff happens to her. Like her facial animation is just like a little off in a way. I love you, Ethan. I miss you so much. I'm sending tons of kisses. Stole my dog, <laughs> my boat. Ethan, you were right. I did lie to you. I shouldn't have. All I can say. Yes, that is part of it. She does not blink often enough <laughs> for like a person. Stay away. Well, good. I think Ethan will follow those instructions and just not mm -hmm. um, we'll just, just move just on with his life. It. It's fine. Yeah. You know what? If somebody tells you to just stay away, you should probably just listen. That's what I think. Hello. Hey, it's uh, it's Ethan. Oh, hey. Oh, the cutscene. Uh, I love this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I'm. I'm good. I'm good. This is Brad at the theater bootlegging Resident Evil 7. They found her? How? What happened? I don't know. Look. Truly no place spookier than the bayou. She's back somehow. Maybe it's a prank. She wants me to come and get her. Where is she? She said stay away! Dolby, Louisiana. You know, she always used to say stay away, and I'd be like, oh, okay, I'm coming. I have to find out what happened. VR driving. That wood paneling on the dashboard, though. Mm hmm. Yeah, was he driving a Studebaker? <laughs> I probably would have kept pulling up more. This is the place. Trophy. Allegedly. No, you got a trophy, not staying away. Mm-hmm. It seems humid. Oh, yeah. Swamps, not nice places. 
Just a lot of bugs everywhere. Oh, find Mia. He's got this. Mm -hmm. Alex, if I sent you a video of me, it looked like I was in the basement and I was like, and I, and I said, yeah, I'm taking a week off you guys. And then I sent you a video that's like, I lied. Just stay away. Did you be like, wow, I guess Finney's just done. I don't know. Yes. <laughs> or, <laughs> or do you be like, I've got to go search for him. No. Okay. No. If you told me to stay away, I'd listen to you. <laughs> I'm not a horror game protagonist. I'm not a moron. Okay. What if I winked? It's like, stay away. You know? Mm. Nah, I'd still take it at face value. Okay. Weird. I think Mia yes. might might be in this murder house. Hmm. Hmm. Yes, Resident Evil 9 is going to take place in the Pine Barrens with me searching for Vinny. <laughs> Said he found this satisfactory code that he needed to somewhere, <laughs> so somewhere around here. It's going to make everything better, more efficient. Too efficient, Alex. The factory <laughs> runs too well. Stay away. See, now I know you're full of shit. <laughs> you would never tell me to stay away from your efficient factory. I'd be like, you need to come join the factory, Alex. You find out the factory runs on human brains. It was the only way. Well, nothing to do but walk Ooh. through the legs. Just, you know, gotta dry that meat out. Mm hmm. Yeah, he's making jerky. <laughs> gonna make jerky out of you. Oh. You big jerky. Mm hmm. Okay, go down that little cliff. No turning around now. Can't get out of there. Uh oh. Wow, they it found the one inflammable person in the world. It's Gucci. So at this point, at this point, you go and you like tell someone else, right? Oh yeah. You're like, oh, I found, a, you know, my missing girlfriend's license in a smoldering pile at this house. Just in case it is not clear, let me establish this right now. Every choice this character would make, I would do the opposite. Okay. You would have brought the lockpick and the hatchet from the jump. I've seen one horror movie. I know. <laughs> I know what not to do. Well, at least he went during the day. At the very least, I would have hired a bunch of armed mercenaries to come with me to do this. And watch them get picked off one by one. Yes. Get Dog the Bounty Hunter out here. I would have hired some actors that were just uh, be like, check their IMDb page, make sure they haven't been in anything that, leading in anything. Hire them if they're supporting actors. Get them so I know mm -hmm. that they're going to get picked off first. Um, so they because they didn't get top billing in my horror movie life. Welcome to the bad house. Shut the door. You're going to be spending some time here. Can't open that with a driver's license, I'm afraid. 
Oh. Yum. <laughs> we have our uh, our first um, uh, pepper, our first chili made it, uh, picked off the plant mm -hmm. today. Woo! It's a hot one. It's going to be a hot yeah. one. Nice. Um, I, I should look up what pepper it is. Kind of, ugh, ah. oh, what kind of pepper it is. Springy. I don't know what we're growing this year. I don't know if I've got the stomach for it anymore. For the hot chilies? We usually, we ferment them into a, a sauce uh, mm -hmm. and it was delicious last year, but man, I bit into that thing to make sure it was ready. Hot. Ta, 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 ta. Yeah, I don't go for like the super heat, but like I do love a good spicy sauce. Oof. I like the, I used to love the super heat bolt, burn a hole in your stomach, but I don't yeah, know. No, if I, my, I don't think it's too so much. Yeah, that's one way take it to Ulcer Town now. <laughs> I think I ate a third of that hot chip when we did the hot chip challenge, and that was mm. enough for me. And then I had to talk Dan through his high. <laughs> But like hot sauce, chili sauce in general, I'll put that shit on anything. Yeah. Put it on ice cream. I don't give a fuck. We're getting into uh, chili season here, which is good. Yeah, we are. And I've got that uh, the instant pot now. So. Oh, man. Just dump stuff in there and just mm -hmm. let it go and chili all day. Nice three bean veggie chili. Yum. Mm hmm. Oh, Brad knows the score. So you're you're pro beans and chili. Oh, is there like a no bean chili? What is a there no bean? There's some people who don't like kidney beans and chili. You know, don't like the, the beans in there. I I'm pro. I I generally want that. I'd go beans before I go any kind of meat. Like Interesting. If you're, if you're gonna take something out, I'd say take the meat out. Give me the beans. Yeah. But that said, I bean, meat and bean chili. Oh, that's the good stuff. It's pretty good. It's rich. Yeah, I think like the chili with no beans is more like that's the stuff you put on hot like chili dogs. Oh, okay. Meat sauce, basically. Um, I'll put a dollop of sour cream on top if I was feeling real. Uh, feeling saucy. With some extra calories. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, here goes Brad. Mm -hmm. Speaking Descending. of getting spicy. Oh. Good. Oh. Cool. oh. Right in the poop water. And you have severed arms. <laughs> Man, water damage stinks. It stinks and it stinks. And it stinks. I'm going to say that more than water damaged this place. Oh, yeah. Oh, this. Okay. This is where I would not. I would never. Nope. Nope. Not getting nope. that water. Nope. I wouldn't even get in that subway water you kept seeing oh, in like. Oh, the, of the, course. The you should not. Yeah, absolutely not. I would certainly wouldn't get in this. Do you mean like scientifically you should not? Not just. Oh, no. gosh. Just. No, no, no. I don't care. There's no train in the world worth getting on for that. I would literally walk the length of Manhattan in the rain before I would do that. There's all sorts of badness. Uh huh. <laughs> uh huh. Glorp. Uh-huh. This is why you don't do this. Yeah. You don't know where that head's been. Oh, that's our that's our uh, reporter friend, right? The uh, guy who was looking One at the wall? Them, yeah. I feel like Brad's just jumped right in here. Ugh. 
When you were growing up, was there like a house that everyone thought was like the bad haunted house? Yeah. Okay. I mean, yes and and yes. I mean, we we were a town uh, town over from Amityville, so we had mm -hmm. the, you know oh, Amityville. Oh, okay. And then we also had like the house that was like a you know not kept up, dark all the time. Mm -hmm. but, you know, like our suburb was pretty. You know, there weren't a lot of like recessed houses. They were pretty close to the street. You know, not a lot of right. property. But yeah, like the the house that's like you don't go trick or treating there. You just skip that. Yeah. House. Did you have yeah, there was a? One of the, yeah, uh, yeah, there was one in my neighborhood that was definitely. It wasn't a murder house or anything, but it was an old Victorian that had fallen into pretty significant disrepair. And the guy who lived there, I think, was the original caretaker of the house that just mm. took it over after the owner died. And he didn't really ever come out very much, except to run errands. And all the windows were like either boarded up or curtained yeah. up, and just the outside looked like kind of like this house. <laughs> oh no. But eventually they restored it is the thing like like decades after I uh, went to school in Petaluma they finally fixed it. something like I don't know if someone else bought it or inherited it or what but they fixed it up and actually looks pretty nice now <laughs> sold it for like uh, seven hundred thousand dollars they uh, turned I, it I around sold it for a cool <laughs> million if we're being honest it was a, it was a good sized Victorian house well it looks like Brad's about to beat the game so good job yeah Hello. Mia. Mia's just tired. Mia's very sleepy. Oh, thank God I found you. It's me. It's Ethan. Ethan? Ethan? Are you all right? What's with your arms? <laughs> what do you mean? You contacted me. No, no, I wouldn't. Rayman? Did I? Did anyone see you? Did he see you? Hey, who else is here? What the hell's going on? Daddy's coming. We need to go. Daddy? We need to go. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't. At first, you're like. Someplace safe. Are you going to tell me what's going on? Baby, you've been gone for three years. Three years? It it's kind of a long time. Years? Yeah, it is. Especially should not know. What? What is this place? <laughs> Subtitles <laughs> clipping. Mm -hmm. We need to get out of here first. I think it's this way. Mia, don't don't think. I need to know now. I know you've been asleep for like three years. We need to go. Oh. Do you? Do you want like a wet wipe or something? Just to kind of. Cup of coffee, maybe. A pair of shoes. I'm a cop. Not me. <laughs> that wasn't me. But you did. I didn't. Okay, fine. Just tell me what's going on. I'm telling you everything that I know. We have to go this way. Well, she says you gotta go that way. No choice. Mia, are you sure you know where you're going? The family used to bring me food through here. I remember. I remember. There. It's there. Hey, the door to the outside. This is it. Don't get scared. It's now. a door. Oh, you found the den. This room. There's another door here. I'm sure of it. It's not here. It's gone. It's gone. Okay, okay. Relax, relax, relax. We're gonna find it. We're gonna be a family now that you're here. 
Ma'am? Sure uh, some things uh, seem to be happening here. Don't, si- don't sit on the couch. That couch, you don't know what's been on that that's, couch. That's a bad couch. You! <laughs> I see a little doll. Brad's been in this basement before. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think not a bad doll. I hey, mean, like, it's a bad doll, but it's, you know. It's like those, um. Not the worst doll. <laughs> I gotta yeah, get these dolls. Doll. Hold on, you know how much these things are worth? Yeah. It's like those, uh, what are those, uh, American kid dolls? The, you know, these things are oh. like $300 a piece. Well, I found the door. So that's good. Well, thank you. Wow, that's extremely nice of you. My hands, are, of them. <laughs> my hands are full of these dolls. Damn, we gotta start quick around these parts. <laughs> my seven-year-old, um, first of all, she had a book fair, and mm-hmm. she wanted she wanted just like horror books. I was like, okay, like goosebumps or like ghost stories and all that stuff. I was mm-hmm. like, okay, and then um, it was like six thirty. And she wanted to go mail a letter. And I was like, it's getting really dark. Like, I don't know. We'll go to the post office tomorrow. We'll go to the mailbox. She's like, I'll just go by myself. And I was like, it's like dark outside. And she gave me such a hard time. She's like, dad, I'm just going to go by myself. You know, it's like maybe a 20 minute walk to the mailbox. And it's, yeah. like, pit, it's like pitch dark out. And I was like, she's like, I'll be fine. I like, I don't. She's at a phase where she does not like being, uh, you know, called a little well, and she's not kid. a she's not a latchkey kid, so she hasn't gotten to the point of like you know just being that level of self sufficient purely out of necessity. Not quite yet, but good honor for being like I'm oh, fine. Yeah. I'll walk in the dark on my own, read these ghost I mean, stories. I used to do that around. I used to do that around my old neighborhood, but like I lived in a very suburban neighborhood that was my parents. They probably still shouldn't have let me, but they <laughs> they definitely let me walk around at least until dusk. Somebody's at the door. Somebody's knocking at the door. That's for all my Ghost Rider Spirit of Vengeance fans nice. out there. Oh, people in the chat. My mailbox. It's not my my mailbox is in front of my door. The mailbox where you mail the post office mailbox. It's 20 minutes away. I mean, can't you put the letters in the mailbox and then the no, person will take it? I don't. I've never done that. I, like I think you can. I've just I think never that's done. still how the I mail think, works. I do I think it, you can do that. I've never done it. Oh, Brad hates this. Oh yeah, look at he's. I can sense. Yep. No, yep, he hates this. <laughs> Ma'am. Mia. Wow, she's strong. Oh boy. Uh, uh, I how many bad things they do to this uh, man's hands. Yes. Wait. Fuck. Jesus. <laughs> uh, there's no good way out of this one now. <laughs> we have got to get you some back teen immediately. I can hear her. I can feel her clawing her way back inside of me. Get out! Leave oh, I forgot about this part, too. Yeah, oh. I'm good back. I deserve this. What the fuck are you, Mia? <laughs> yeah. 
Ah, ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Necessary, but yeah. This is probably a better way to just dump that right on there. All right, what do you think Brad's up to now? I'm sure he doesn't want to wander too far. Did say to check on Mia. I don't know if he noticed that or not. Oh! <laughs> she woke up. <laughs> wow, she knows jujitsu. <laughs> it's like a good hold. Ah ha ha! Look, uh, man. She's just going through a phase, all right? Right. <laughs> 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 oh. Okay, you need to change back. You need. You need to change. I. Well, your mon. Your monster. That's ball game, folks. <laughs> Phone's ringing, dude. This isn't a good time, maybe. Are you happy with your long distance carrier? <laughs> Ugh. Shouldn't have come here. Who's this? And what the fuck is going on? My name's Zoe. There should be a way out through the attic. Attic. Go there. <laughs> now. Thank you, Brad. <laughs> Trying to get those subtitles in the spot. Yeah, that's funny. Tranquil Cappy in the chat asking, were long distance carriers like separate from your normal carrier? Yeah, the whole long distance thing was a whole thing for a long mm -hmm. time. You kids don't know. You don't know. <laughs> I wonder if Brad realizes I don't think that. she's dead. Yeah, that used to be in Mia. I actually really love it when Vmix like chokes for a second because again we get very creepy Brad reaction of like, yeah. <laughs> that was a really good impression of that. <laughs> very like yeah, very like Japanese horror mm -hmm. ring or bad American version of Japanese horror. <laughs> yes. You saw did you ever see that House on Haunted Hill remake? I know I did not. I'm I'm saving it okay. for the uh We'll do some kind of thing with it. Look, it's not a great movie, but it is also it is one that has a bunch of ghosts just doing the shaky head thing over and over and over <laughs> again. People in the chat are discussing long distance carriers. Just what we <laughs> intended for this uh -huh. stream. That's right. Now let's teach the kids about one eight hundred collect. One eight hundred. No, that's what was the, the that's something else. Yeah, that's I the idea what collect jingle was, but I was doing the mattress one. Yeah, mattress in an hour. One eight hundred M A T T R E S. Ah, it's a fusing episode. That's pretty funny. What? It's good. The fusing episode. That was good. Oh, okay. The yeah. delayed reaction. I couldn't tell if you're being sarcastic or, or not. I, it took me a second to process. I had to, I had to work it through. <laughs> oh, Brad's reacting. Something here he don't like. He saw Mia kind of crept by the camera. Hmm.
say it's nice to be playing a game that has no real risk of being DMCA'd, as far as I can tell. <laughs> Not yet. When they start playing House of the Rising Sun in the second act, mm -hmm. then, uh... Fuck. Jesus, ma'am. Hey. Hey, hey. Good say. Hey. What's, what's behind your back, Mia? Lady, you're kind of all over the place here. It's fucking hard. <laughs> and that didn't? This poor dude's hand, yeah. really. You're gonna be uh, <laughs> You'll be okay, Brad. Let's give her a hand, folks. Uh huh. Uh huh. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Uh -huh. That's like severed on both ends, so it's uh, a. <laughs> That's not gonna do it. That ain't gonna do it, man. <laughs> You're gonna need to cauterize that shit. It's, uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna wanna hold on to that. The disembodied, like, forearm is just so <laughs> yeah. good in this context. It's so silly. <laughs> it's a little nugget of arm left. I don't have time to play this tape. I'm bleeding out. Ah, the deep breath of a man. <laughs> Holding his own severed arm. Happy <laughs> to have found a safe point. <laughs> I have a feeling Ethan would have bled out about 30 seconds ago. There's a lot of things that would have happened to Ethan in these games that I'm pretty sure would have killed him in an instant. Mm. Yeah, I'd like, uh, I haven't played RE8, but they go like they double down on the hand stuff in that game. I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna tell you this, Alex. Mm -hmm. I think Brad's gonna really dislike this part coming up. Yeah. Oh, wait, yeah, okay. All right. I think I remember what you're talking about here. Okay, fine. <laughs> now you got all the bullets. Get all the bullets. I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna get some, uh, some, oh, come on, what the, what the F, man, is what I think we're gonna get. Well, at least he saved. Mm hmm. Should probably save again after getting that stuff. Well, we'll have that conversation with him later. 1 800. You got that jingle stuck in your head now. Oh, don't you? man, they did it. Okay. Is, is he gonna go for the extra save? If I were him, I would, but... Mm -hmm. Who knows what Brad might be thinking? <laughs> He's going to bust up every crate. I mean, he needs that good, good, goodness. Fuck these crates. Well, time to go.
He knows what's coming up. Brad is no fool. He knows whatever it is, it's bad. He definitely... He's played a game before. Not me, though. I've never played one. Alex, you've this is your first game, and I'm very impressed. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Shit. Fuck! Oh, I got one hand. All you need is one hand to shoot, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see how we do here. Mm hmm. Shit. I don't know if that's the best room to be in, but. She got bored. The core. The core might be destroyed. <laughs> oh, you've, you've given us the extreme zoom. I appreciate uh -huh. that. Ah. Uh. <laughs> <Huh? laughs> There's a uh, in the Discord chat. There's a pretty uh. good. Uh, Alex Skiff. No. Hopefully that mm -hmm. makes it outside there. Fuck! I'd love to, but you keep trying to kill me. No! <laughs> Say it again, you're kind of all over the map here. You know, there's a lot of stuff happening. Gonna need you to pull it together for a few minutes here. Brad ain't done. Brad wants to finish the job. Oh. <laughs> mm-hmm. It's good, like, stick it on your arm like ash. <laughs> oh, fuck. I mean, you knew he'd be along eventually. Oh, ah. Pretty good job with the, the Mia fight. Yeah. I, th I thought that would go, uh, be a lot tougher. Is this the, uh, is this the, the dinner table? Th I think it is. I think okay. it is. Come on. Don't you die on us now. You have work to do. Is that Zoe who does who does that? Don't remember. It's been so long. Hmm. This is this all might as well be new to me at this point. I remember not making it too much further past the dinner scene. Where? Where am I? What the hell? Rise and shine, sleepyhead. It's time for supper. Who who are all you people? Where's Mia? <laughs> Eat it. It's good. Dumb some bitch wasn't no good if it hit him. <laughs> his boy's got to eat. He got to have his supper. Come here, boy. You people need therapy. <laughs> Special feast. Come on, boy. Ah, 
ow, 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 ow. Well, soon me, Grandma. <laughs> Ow. How are his hands looking? Wait, he's got it back. Yeah, it's got his little monitor on. <laughs> Nana. Grandma fell asleep during a uh, <laughs> matlock again. <laughs> uh huh. You know, wake up, mm -hmm. get your hand staple back on. Check out the fridge. Definitely don't just run to the door. I told you, I would make every other decision that this person <laughs> did not make. I like their tinfoil backstop. Got to stop that oil from splashing mm -hmm. over there, you know? Is it just water from splashing up on there? I think you'd have that behind the stove. They use a lot of canola oil. Mm. the way you you <laughs> utilize extreme close up oh boy You forgot. Mm hmm. Where in the hell are you think you're going, you son? Boom! Oh. 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 <laughs> Again, that is like maybe the 13th worst thing that has happened to your arm so far. <laughs> This first time he starts chasing him around, I remember it was very harrowing because you don't really know where anything is. Hmm. I'm waiting. I forget how you get the. Oh. I kind of forget how you get things started here. <laughs> You're wasting your time. God 
damn it. I wonder. I wonder if Brad could be walking faster. Is this a VR thing? I feel like I didn't get, didn't catch up with me this much when I played. I don't remember. He definitely is like fast, but yeah, I don't know. I can't tell if like there is a run button that he's not using or what. It's okay, it's the first encounter. We're figuring it out. Mm. Okay, there is, I think, a run button. Okay. He may just not know about it. Oh. <laughs> oh man, poor Brad. Seems like he's getting yeah. frustrated. Well, that's the thing. I think we might have to indicate this one. Let's see where it puts him. It's got to crouch around. There you go. Come on, get the run tip. Get the run tip. He'll come to us when he wants the advice. Mm -hmm. I do love that they have like a surround speaker set up. Hey, they know how to party, okay? There might be a house full of horrible murderers. But they're all about that Dolby Atmos. <laughs> Let's see if he can stealth his way through. We'll find out. Yeah. Uh oh. I think Daddy saw you. Uh. I think he is running. <laughs> yeah, now it seems like he's moving a lot faster. Oh. I think he's, he's got, got it now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, oh. Well, he's got more of it. <laughs> Just gotta find that hatch. I told you. Don't you fuck with me. Who's fucking with who? I'm just trying to get out of here, man. Found ya! No, 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 Get in there. God, come on. Oh, uh, as long as he keeps blocking, I think he can do this for a while. Hmm. He might have to, like, lose him and then crouch around. 
go. I get out of the way. It's not really what he does, Brad. <laughs> Go on, you got this. No, 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 no. I think you can you can get down there now if you uh yeah successfully juke him out. Just does another loop. Yeah. Oh. Get him the hatch. Thank you. <sighs> Even I was holding my breath. It's just like those Emmys. Oh, you know what? Crawl spaces creep me out. It's true. I have never liked a crawl space. Just bugs and dampness. I feel like we don't have a lot of them on the East Coast because of the... I guess you could have one under maybe a deck or a porch or something, but mm -hmm. you know, it's, it's a lot of basements. Yes, it is. <laughs> yeah, my best friend growing up had a really good crawl space under his house that was uh, both the right mix of incredibly fucking creepy and also weirdly spacious. <laughs> Probably a lot of spiders down there. I didn't spend a lot of time hanging out down there. Oh, oh, that might come in handy. Is there a save point around here? Oh, yeah, no, tape deck, tape deck. Crate. Yeah, he's got his item. Chems. How's he doing on health? Gotta check his like Fitbit. Could probably put that coin away if he wanted. Oh, does he see the bobblehead? Will Brad see the bobblehead and uh Will he see the bobblehead? Will he save? I think he's gonna save the big questions. He's gonna smash the bobblehead. Come on, Brad, hit that bobblehead. He hears it. Uh oh. Oh, I think he might be wondering he, if it's time. Is he checking the time? Hello. Hi. Hi. How's it going, sweetie? Oh, no, he can't hold on. Uh, 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 he's got to switch his headphones. He's getting out of the game. Brad is jacking out. Mm -hmm. Jacking back in. Gonna get him like a selector. There it is. There Hello. It is. Hi. Are you Hi. feeling? Are you feeling ready How to punch doing, out? How are we feeling? How are we? It's doing? about four forty. Yeah. Boy, that guy. Yeah. What yeah. A guy. What a guy. What he's is a, this game. <laughs> so, were you able to? Are you able to run Ooh. in VR? Yeah, I was running. That was the running. I don't know. Yeah. I, don't know seemed, if, I don't know if it's the first I don't know if it's time. Obvious. I, I think the first time it felt like maybe you weren't running, but the second time no, you I definitely was, were. I was absolutely surprised. I started sprinting in beginning hour. Oh okay. man, it's it's, yeah, no, it's just it feels like, slower. I don't know if it's a VR I, I, thing. I think or what? Uh, there's it totally. Uh, I can't. I can't <laughs> see the screen and also hang on. Uh, no, that's totally a VR setting. Like they limit your. Like, see, there's a 
I jacked, I jacked walking speed up as high as it would go. Oh, it only stays at normal. Okay. Normal is as normal is as high as it goes. So, okay. But, I guess you're just slower. I was, I was sprinting. You could, there is definitely a speed difference. I was, yeah. I started doing that in the prologue. Okay. I mean, maybe, maybe my memory is just Ethan is, I mean, he's a slow moving dude. What do you think? It's a fucked up game. Yo, what happened to your yeah. hand? This game is messed up. This game is messed up. Uh, so you're good Whatever. to you good to pause here for a bit? Yeah, yeah. We, okay. You want to call it there? Yeah, we'll call it there. We'll come back. Uh, come back and yeah, join us. They stuck. They stuck the hand right back on. Let's you know. Just mm -hmm. works. Nope. Just works. No harm. No harm. Jam no it on there. Ugh, man. What a ugh. Grody. A gro it's it's a grody, house, grody. Man. grody is the word for this game. Ugh. And you didn't eat dinner. Mom was mad. Mm, no. I'm gonna take it over to us here over here, in the VR zone. Uh, yeah, that's, I mean, that's the beginning of Resident Evil seven. Sure was. Uh, you got a coin, mm -hmm. you got your, you got your not filthy coin. We're going to play through. Gone. We'll come back to this, um, more next week. Yeah. Yes. Uh, you're going to get your collectibles folks. That's, that's right. going to do it for this. Uh, do we have a name for this? I'm going to think of a name for, uh, yes. the, um, YouTube video. Put, put the, the helmet on, over. Brad. Mm -hmm. Put the put the glasses on. That's the name. I I don't think I can ever take it off again. <laughs> yep. You're stuck in VR. That's, That's gonna right. do it for this week's show. Heck of a week <laughs> this week. Tomorrow you could join us as we shadow gates. Get shadowy with shadow gates uh, tomorrow. You can join us there. We're gonna continue playing that as Shocktober continues. October with a shocking amount of scary games. More Resident Evil Seven coming next week. Along with some more Hitman stuff, podcast is up. You can check all that out. Brad, thank you very much. Thank you. Good job, Brad. It's Nicely done. Nice job on that Mia fight. Yeah. Uh, Ugh. Ugh. Can't believe you did that. Alex Navarro, thank you. I got a raid queued up. All right. Thanks, everybody, for watching. And we will be back next week. Hit that raid. See ya.